Welcome back to ACA Lions to another edition of the Lions Den Broadcasting. I'm Pastor Jason. And I'm Miss Goodbread. It's Monday, August 22nd. Let's all please stand for the national anthem. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hail at the twilight last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight all the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say does that star's bangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave now on to our news pastor jason so this week, of course, we have hot lunches going on, but I wanted to give you guys a little breakdown of what's gonna be happening with the lunches. First of all, lunches are coming from the Southern Deli. If you've never eaten there, that place is quite good. But here's the menu that's gonna be going on. Mondays, we're gonna have cheeseburgers and chicken tenders for all the, like, the dip in those tenders. Tuesday, we have grilled cheese. Wednesday, we have tenders, uh, chicken tenders again, but then we also have the bougie mac and cheese if you've ever I'm had the mac and cheese. I'm excited about the bougie mac and cheese. It's quite delicious if you ever had it. If you go there, it's actually called the mac crack and cheese, but it's incredibly good, but that's gonna be on Wednesday. Thursdays, we have chicken tenders again, and also pe uh, peanut butter and jelly. And then Friday, everybody's favorite day, it's pizza, pizza day. So that'll be on Friday for uh, from the Southern Deli. There's awesome. also some delicious yeah, sides there too. Yeah, we have great sides, chips, applesauce, also salad, which is great. We never had salad before, so that's a really fun addition. And check that fax portal to make sure you have the full list and you know what every day is so you don't forget. Also, we had volleyball tryouts happening last week. Awesome. Um, they have been going so great. The girls have been really into it. And actually, we had a field reporter go out there and tell us what's happening. So let's go to that. Let's head on to the field reporter. Hello, ACA Lions. I'm Judah Fletcher here with Coach Faye. How was the girls' volleyball team today? They're looking really, really good. I mean, we're being, this is the second day. We're on the tryouts and they're looking amazing. I, I think we're gonna have a really good season. How do you think the turnout with the new games are gonna come? I'm really excited and we just need all of you guys there to cheer us on. Are you gonna come watch us? I'm gonna come watch you guys. Thanks, we appreciate all the support you guys can give. Now our last and final news is picture day. Picture day! This is on Thursday, so please come prepared, dress your best, and like Pastor Jason said last week, get that haircut and be ready because these are gonna go in the yearbook. Yearbook, that's gonna be awesome. We do have a interview with our fine arts program director, so let's go ahead and cut to that. Let's go out there, let's meet Mrs. McDaniel. ACA, we are here with our fine arts director, Mrs. McDaniel, who's going to tell us a little bit about what is going to happen with fine arts this year. Mm -hmm. What qualifies you to be a member of the fine arts team? In order to be on any of the fine arts teams, you have to be in good academic standing. That means you have to work on your grades. Uh, your behavior has to be even better than what is expected. Your work turned in that you got uh, last week, make sure you turn that in. Some teams even require a sports physical that has to be turned in in order to do it. And then we have auditions where you come and you try it out, you see what you like, and we help you figure out um, what team would be great for you. Yes. What are the teams this year? How many do we have? Awesome. Can you give us a little description about them? Absolutely. This year we have nine different wow. teams that we are offering after school. Four of them are for ages third grade up through eighth grade and those would be choir, and we can have up to 75 people in the choir. We really want everybody to try to be in the choir. We have acting team for grades third through eighth grade. We have human video for grades third through eighth grade, and sixth grade through 12th grade, and we have 
our puppetry, our black bag puppetry. We have our human video senior team and we have an acting team. We have a new team this year called Unconventional Percussion. We get to bang on drums and do all kinds of cool percussion. And then we also have our musical theater team. You check the times on the paperwork that you were given because the times have changed this year. Um, we have so much fun. I personally love this program and I love watching them compete. It's always such a blessing and they have a great ministry. So if you de if you want to become a part of this, definitely get with Ms. McDaniels to ensure you answer any questions, get those slips turned in, and we look forward to seeing you perform. Woo! Well, this has been another edition of the Lion's Den Broadcasting. But before we go, let's end in prayer. Heavenly Father, thank you for another great Monday. As we kick off this week, we just thank you that you are here with us this whole week. I thank you, Lord, too, as your blessing is on us, as the Bible tells us that we can outshine all the children of this world ten times brighter in all wisdom, knowledge, and skill of learning. We thank you for this great week that we're going to have, and we give you all the glory in Jesus' mighty name. And everyone said, Amen. Amen. Well, we thank you for joining us. I'm Pastor Jason. And I'm Miss Goodbread. And this has been your Daily, Daily Roar. Roar.